Okay, so uh, we move on to the next scenario. Uh, this scenario is uh, very common in Malaysia, and uh, which is how can you manage a backdated uh, invoice? So let's create a new invoice. Uh, okay, so I build auto count. Let's say I do something, 50 ringgit. And imagine that uh, this is the uh, 1st of October compared to today. As you can see on my date on the bottom, uh, today is uh, November. So I try to approve this invoice, which is save this e-invoice. And let us refresh. And you will see an invalid uh, e-invoice status return to me. So let us view and it will say issuance date time value of the document is too old so this is the lhdn error to me it's trying to tell me that you are backdating uh, too long so in uh, lhdn uh, perspective they only accept uh, three days before so but this invoice comparing to today's date is one month before so what should i do now is uh, I can edit this invoice. We make use of a function which is provided by AutoCount that is issue date time. So we can put today's date from at here. And we click OK and we save. So once we save, uh, it will be automatically resubmitted. And I will just need to click refresh and you can see it is now valid. And let's move on to look into our My Invoice portal. So you can see this uh, invoice uh, is successfully submitted to LHDN uh, with the date of 1st November. All right. So in your own accounting, this invoice is reflected at October. So you have two dates over here. One is your posting date and another one is your submission date. So uh, to manage the uh, e-invoice uh, for backdated cases, don't worry about the submission date, right? From LHDM perspective, there is no specific timing for e to issue e-invoice. This you can find in the uh, FAQ uh, guide, all right? So what we can see, to double confirm, we can look back into our ledger. So you can see the sales is posted on 1st October instead of 1st November. So in your accounting perspective, everything is correct. And you also submit the invoice uh, successfully to LHDN. So make use of the issue, take time, the function that is provided by AutoCount on how you can handle backdated invoice.